Good morning, church family. It is good to be together with you today. Today, I've been having a lot of fun playing with a special toy with Lola, and it's this. Let me show you how she likes to play with it. I wanted to show you something about fishing today because today's story has to do with fishing. Let's take a look. One day, Jesus was standing near the Sea of Galilee. Many people were pushing to get near him. They wanted to hear what he had to say. Jesus saw two boats on the shore. Fishermen were not in them because they were washing their nets. Then Jesus got into the boat and asked them to push it out a little way into the water. He sat there and taught the people from the boat. The boat belonged to brothers called Simon and Andrew. When Jesus had finished teaching, he spoke to them, Go into the deep water and let down your nets. Simon said to him, Teacher, we worked hard fishing all night and caught nothing. But if you say so, we will let down the net. When they had done what Jesus told them to do, they caught so many fish, their nets started to break. They waved to their friends in the other boat to come help them. They filled both boats to the brim with fish. Simon was overwhelmed by all the fish. He got down at the feet of Jesus. He said, don't waste your time with a man like me, teacher. Andrew, James, and John, and everyone there was in wonder because of the many fish. Then Jesus said to Simon, don't worry, follow me and you will fish for people. So they left everything and followed Jesus. God demonstrates his own love for us in this, that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. Now, did you notice in our story today the fishermen were not fishing with a pole and a line like this. What did they have? They fished together side by side with a big net. Now, how do you catch a fish with a big net? I have a special video for you guys today to take a look at some fishermen working together to catch fish in a net.
brothers in that movie were working very hard together to pull in all of those fish into their boat. In just the same way, Simon and Andrew were two brothers who had to work together and even call more friends over to help them pull all of those fish into their boat. Later, when they left their nets and their boats to follow Jesus, they didn't do it all alone. They went side by side even still. It's important to remember when we think about following Jesus that we are not all alone. There are people who are side by side following Jesus along with us. Who is side by side with you this morning? I hope it's someone really special. And if you don't have anybody physically side by side with you right now, I want you to know that I am side by side with you in spirit. You know, I am always praying for you guys. And sometimes my prayer lists get a little bit long. So I do something special. I do some little doodling while I pray. I might write your name down and I might write some little pictures around it and color in around it while I pray for you. That way I don't get too distracted. I'm thinking about God and I'm thinking about you. There are some really neat resources that you can use to do the same thing at home. If you go to the website called Praying in Color, you can download some special sheets that'll help you to pray for your friends. Some of them even have a shape of like a net, just like the fish net we saw in our video today. You can also go to our CPC Sunday morning newsletter and look in the link for this video. There's a link for a PDF that you can print out and use that to write down the people that you are praying for. Let's pray together now. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much that you created a community of brothers and sisters in Christ. Help us to walk faithfully side by side with our brothers and sisters. We thank you so much for the love that you pour out on our community. We pray these things in the loving name of Jesus, amen. Well, church family, I miss you. I'm gonna be praying for you and writing down your name on my sheet. I hope you guys have a great week. I'll see you later.